Hello friends, today we will see the trick for CMOS logic family based sum. So first we will see the concept, then we will move to the trick, then at the end we will see the gate sum. So starting with the schematic representation of PMOS and NMOS. So for PMOS you will see this kind of schematic, you will see bubble here and you will see the arrow here. Basically the source of PMOS is here, brain is here and gate is here. Okay, so always the arrow will be in the source terminal so you will see arrow here while in NMOS you will see arrow here as the source is here drain is here and gate is here okay so in sum either you will get get this arrow or this bubble or you can get both of this okay so now we will see for what logic this PMOS will be short circuit and for what logic this NMOS will be short circuit so if suppose if we give logic 0 at input for PMOS then this will be short circuit okay basically you can say this PMOS gate will be on and if you give logic 1 that is high then this PMOS will be off basically open circuit okay now in NMOS if you give logic 1 then in, it will be short circuit on if you give logic 0 then it will be off open circuit okay okay now we will see the trick so trick here is we have to always focus on this NMOS transistor and PMOS transistor will be complement of this NMOS transistor basically what do I mean by this complement is if suppose NMOS is in series then PMOS will be in parallel okay and even this NMOS and PMOS are complement to each other okay one thing you should take note of it is NMOS is best capable of providing logic 0 basically ground and PMOS is best suitable for providing logic 1 basically VDD okay that's why you have seen most most of the time PMOS at upper side and NMOS at lower side which is connected to ground and PMOS is connected to VDD so now if, if suppose you have to build a NOT gate from this CMOS then what you will do is you will first make the NMOS okay you will connect it to ground this source of this NMOS is connected to ground and you have this A here this input will be same for PMOS also as you as you know for the NOT gate we want only one terminal at input and one terminal at output okay now here we are making the PMOS from here we will take the output and this PMOS source will be connected to plus VDD okay this is PMOS this is NMOS okay and this is A as an input okay so here you see in NMOS what we have seen is if we give logic 1 then this NMOS gets short circuited okay so if this A is at logic 1 then this NMOS will be short circuited okay so what you can see is this ground will be connected to this output if the uh, input is logic i so what does it means is if input is 1 then output will be 0 similarly if input is 0 then output will be 1 why I am saying this is when input is 0 then this NMOS will be disconnected basically off and for 0 this PMOS is 1 uh, this on, PMOS is on so this PMOS will be short circuited and this VDD will get connected to this output that's why we will get 1 at the output so here you can see this circuit will act as a NOT gate now I suppose we have to build NAND gate using NMOS so what we will do first we will make AND gate then similar to the inverter what we have done that is by taking the output from drain we can get the complement so 
from one of the drain we will take the output and we will get the output as NAND so what I'm saying is first we will make AND gate so for AND gate we will place two AND MOS in series so these two branch will create AND and now if we take output from one of the drain we will get complement of this so basically A dot B bar similar to inverter, inverter what we have seen earlier okay now this uh, PMOS will be complement of this NMOS so PMOS will be in parallel A B okay from this we will take output this is getting connected to plus PD okay so if you want to verify it you can verify it with truth table let's say A B Y for 0 0 if both this is both the input are 0 so this two NMOS will get disconnected this two will be short circuited so VDD uh, output will be output will be connected to VDD so we will get output as 1 for 0 1 0 1 so this will be connected this will be disconnected 0 1 this will be connected this will be disconnected so we will get VDD as an output 1 0 one zero this will be connected this will be disconnected one zero this will be connected so output we get as one 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 so both are uh, both the input is one so we'll get output as zero since both will be short circuited okay this is what two table of NAND gate now if suppose we have to build NOR gate so what we will do first we will make OR gate then we will take output from drain then we will get output as NOR gate okay so we will focus on NMOS only so for OR gate we have to make branch in parallel okay this will be A this will be B PMOS will be just complement of this NMOS so both the PMOS will be in series plus VDD A B okay this is B and from here we will take output okay so this two branch will create OR gate and if we take out uh, from uh, from this terminal then we will get complement of this A plus B so at output we will get A plus B the bar okay so if you want to verify it you can verify it also A B Y so for 0 0 for 0 0 both of this will get disconnected for this 0 0 this both uh, both this PMOS will get short circuited so we will get output as 1 for 0 1 0 1 this will be connected so output will, output will be connected to ground so 0 1 0 1 0 this will be short circuited so we will get output as 0 1 1 both will be connected so we will get output as 0 basically this output terminal is getting connected to ground terminal okay so this is what two table of NOR gate so what we can conclude is to get AND gate uh, we will place two NMOS in series for OR gate we will place two NMOS in parallel and if we take output from the drain we will get complement of that basically complement of AND it will be NAND gate complement of OR it will be NOR gate that will be useful while uh, getting the expression in gate sums okay now we will see the gate sum so we have given with this circuit and we need to find the expression of this circuit so okay as I, as I have said earlier, we will always focus on this NMOS. So here you can see this in this branch, this NMOS is connected in series. So we will get A dot C. Okay. And this two branch is connected in parallel. So what we will get R in between and this B. Okay. So basically sum of products. So at the output, we will get A dot C plus B the whole bar. Okay. This, this is the expression of this circuit. So if you want to verify this, you can verify also, let's say A, B, C, Y, okay. We will check for only one combination, let's say for 0, 1, 0, A, 0, C, 0, A, 0, dot 0, plus 1, complement, so we will get 0. So this is, this is what we will verify with this circuit also, A, 0, C, 0, so both will be disconnected and B is 1 so this will be connected so output is getting connected to ground so we will get output as 0 ok now we have this second circuit we need to find the expression so here you can see is 
B and C are connected in parallel. So from this two branch, what we will get as B plus C. And this two branch are connected in series. So we will get B dot B plus C dot A. And since the output is taken from one of its drain, so we will get complement at the output. Okay. So the expression will be A dot B plus C complement. Okay. If you want to verify it, you can verify also. Let's say A, B, C, Y. Okay. So for the same combination, we will set 0, 1, 0. A is 0, C is 0. A is 0. So 0 multiplied with 0 dot anything will be 0. So 0 complement output will be 1. Okay. So from circuit, if you verify A is 0, so this will be disconnected. So we need, uh, we don't need to check for this since this middle one is disconnected. So this path will be disconnected. Now here, a is 0 so this will be connected B is 1 this will be not uh, disconnected this will be connected so here you can see this VDD will be will get connected to output from this A and MOS ok so output will be 1 so you can see this combination get verified ok that's it for today hello friends if you like my video please like this video share with your friends and subscribe to my channel Thank you.